BricsCAD software has open architecture. We can further extend the capability of the software using plugins called third-party apps. BricsCAD supports more than 1,500 apps and now we have apps for almost all specific applications such as civil site design, HVAC, piping design, electrical design, reinforcement design, satellite and aerial imagery, photorealistic rendering, to name a few. You can be either a user of these third-party apps or you can be an app developer. Visit Brixis.com website, go to product section and over here you can see applications for BricsCAD. Just click on that. Now you have reached on to the BricsCAD applications page. Over here you can see various applications for your specific needs. On the left side you can see the compatibility with the BricsCAD version and apps are also listed based on various category and you will see free as well as paid apps based on the various operating systems. You can download and install an app by clicking on the app thumbnail. For example, to install the Enscape app which is used for real-time photorealistic rendering, just click on this app thumbnail and here you can download a 30-day trial. By clicking on Add to Cart, you can purchase it. So click on I agree to the extended privacy statement button and click on download. And the installer is downloaded. Now run the Enscape setup file by double clicking. Accept the terms. Next, next and install. Now I'll open the BricsCAD software. Click on 3D Modeling Interface. I'll open a drawing file. Now you can see the Enscape tab as an additional tab in the ribbon interface. Click on this tab to see the various options to perform photorealistic rendering. So this is a procedure to install a third-party app in BricsCAD. You can also work as a BricsCAD app developer because BricsCAD is very open to developers who want to create plugins that can work on the top of the software for personal or commercial use. You can customize BricsCAD by adding custom programs written in any of the several programming languages that can run within BricsCAD in Lisp, C, C++, VB, VBA, VB.net. BricsCAD offers several APIs such as COM, BRX, TX, .NET, etc. Within BricsCAD, we can run many programs originally created for use with AutoCAD in Autolisp and .DVB formats. BricsCAD also supports AutoCAD dialog control language DCL which is used to customize dialog boxes. To write an application in C or C++, BricsCAD offers a C++ language interface called BricsCAD Runtime Extension or BRX. And the written code is compatible with AutoCAD Runtime Extension or ARX. Now let's see the procedure to register as a developer in BricsCAD. Visit Brixis.com website. In the Learn and Support section, there is Access BricsCAD API option. Just click on that. Over here, we have an option to register as a developer. Now you are supposed to log in with your login credentials. If you don't have the login credentials, you can sign up and get one. I'll click on Login. Here, you can specify the platform, whether it is AutoCAD, OEM with AutoCAD, or BricsCAD, etc. In the Developed With section, we have options to choose various languages. You can also click on the application category, whether it is AEC, Civil, etc. If you are developing a commercial application, you can activate this button. 
Now I'll click on BricsCAD, Lisp, Civil and I'll click on Register. Now your developer registration has been completed. When you do this, a mail will be sent to local country manager to inform about this new developer. And the country manager will reach out to the developer by mail or phone to understand the requirements. If the developer is with a commercial solution, they will be given a BricsCAD NFR key, which is a note for resale license and access to BRX SDK files, which is the BricsCAD API. This is the procedure to register as a third party application developer in BricsCAD. Please find the relevant links at the description section of this video.